about how the baby plant is sent off by the mother plant. When a baby plant is sent off, and he is sent off with protection and food, it is sent away to settle down and produce a new plant. But there is a problem for the baby plant. She cannot remain near her parents because she will not survive. For us, it is comfortable to settle down with her parents because they take care of us. But the baby plant cannot do that because there might not be enough light to make food or maybe not even enough water. Once the plant settles, it cannot move again. The plant has developed different clever ways to send away its seeds. What kind of seed depends on animals to carry the seeds away? The plant gives the gift of the fruit. When the fruit is ripe, it will pull the animal with its colors and scent. So the animal will come and eat the fruit. If the seeds are large, like in mango, the animal will eat the good part and leave the seeds wherever it, 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 it eats it, to just drop it there. But then if the seeds are small and digestible, like in strawberry, the animal will eat everything and then will deposit the seeds somewhere else with its own manure. So there is a fruit that when the seed is ripe and ready, it will explode and send the seeds flying. Others that use the wind to disperse are like para parachutes. Some seeds have wings, as it were. We also have seeds that float, like the coconut. They float across the water, and when they reach land, they will settle down. Some seeds are hitchhikers. They just attach themselves to animals and travel along. So we can see in this chart the different level ways that the plant sends its seeds away. Here we have those plants that depend on animals. You can see here, they go here right in front and then finally come out through the back door. Now look at an example of the seeds, the plant that, plants that explode in order to send away their seeds. This is an example of plants that send away their seeds by water. They float on the water and finally get to a land, a piece of land and will settle there. And this is an example of seeds that attach themselves to animals. So wherever the animals could get to, they just get there and finally drop off there. And this is an example of plants that send away their seeds using the wind. 
like a parachute. So, we can go ahead and carry out our own research to discover the different ways that plants send out their seeds and also examples of such plants. Find out and let us know what you come up with.